was out then. Good to see you. Good evening. Welcome to the Human Town Church tonight. We're so glad that you have come. And uh, this is going to be a wonderful evening of music. And we love Penview. We're sort of the home crowd for them, but let's not be the homely crowd, okay? So let's respond and let's worship God tonight and let's praise Him. I'd like if you would stand with me for just a moment. Brother Wes McDonald is coming to lead us uh, in some singing in just a moment. But turn to someone near you. Don't go across the church, but just turn to someone near you. Tell them it's good uh, to see them in God's house. Would you do that? Amen. Let's do our best in the congregational singing to worship God and to, to love him and serve him. And then as the choir comes to minister to us, let's just have open and receptive hearts. Let's give God the glory tonight. Brother McDonald, come. Let's remain standing as we sing. Hymn number 436. 436. It's good to be here at Beaver Town tonight to worship together. And I'm so thankful for the rock that we can stand on tonight. The rock Christ Jesus. What a change he has made. And what a change he can make. And we can walk with him. Let's sing it together.
Amen. Well, what a great God we serve tonight. Amen. Amen. The song says, He went to the cross and He gladly bared my burden and your burden tonight. And I'm so thankful that He did that for you and for me. And truly, we have much to praise the Lord for tonight. And that's why we've come to Beavertown on this Sunday night. We've come on purpose to lift up and magnify the precious name of Jesus. And that's exactly what this next song is all about. It says, Lord, here in this place, we have come to worship and we've come to lift up our praise. And we just invite you to enter in with us and worship with us as the young people sing the song here in this place.
Well, I want to thank the Lord tonight. I'm glad that we can be here and worship the Lord tonight. We serve a, a big God, and he's good to each and every one of us, and I just love him tonight. I want to go all the way through with him. I love the Lord, and I love how that song was talking about praising the name of Jesus, and I just love his name, and I just, it's so worthy of praise, how God would come down on earth to become a man, and take my place on a cross, and pay for my sins. I am not worthy of any of his love, but I just want to praise his name, and worship with us uh, as we praise the name of Jesus.
thankful. I'm thankful for the Lord, and I'm thankful for the grace that he gives us, as the next song says about his grace and what it all can do, and I'm thankful for that tonight. In the name of the Lord tonight, I'm so glad for everything he has done in my life. He has blessed me in so many ways. I want him to thank him especially for um, an answer of prayer just this past week. Um, it was something little, but it, it meant a lot to me, and I just want to thank him and praise him. I'm so glad he saves and keeps. I'm going to go all the way through with him. for God's grace in my life that he changed me and I'm not who I was and that he he felt that he could take care of a sinner like me that he accepted me into his family next next song that we're going to sing is orphans of God 
And I'm so thankful that there are no orphans in the family of God, that he can take the worst sinner among us and that he can bring them into his loving arms and that he can cleanse us from our sin and that we can be, we have our earthly families, but yet we can have a heavenly family also. And I'm so thankful for all that he's done in my life and that all he will continue to do in my life. thankful for the grace that God has extended in my life, and it's just incredible to think that God can take each one of our mistakes and each one of the things that we do wrong, and through His grace, He can turn it into something good. I'm so thankful in my life that He has taken everything that I have messed up on, and He has forgiven me of those things, and then He's come back to just pick me up and to help me on, to carry me on. I just want to continue to go through with Him the rest of my life.
want to thank God that there is no orphans with God and that when it says that um, there are no strangers, there are no outcasts, I should be an outcast. I shouldn't even be here. God seen something in me that I didn't even see in myself and that he's like, I'm going to use you. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to make you what I want you to be. I just want to bring people to him so that they don't have to feel like they have to be an orphan, that God will take them. There's no orphans with God. I want to thank him for that. Amen. Well, what a powerful thought that there are no orphans of God. I'm just, I'm so thankful for the grace of God in my own life that he didn't, he didn't let me out in the cold. He didn't leave me there. He just, he came and he picked me up. He said, Darren, I have a place for you in my kingdom. I have a place for you with me. And I just, I love him this evening for that fact tonight. And as this next song says, I've, I've seen a timeless truth and my life is living proof of the grace of God. And I just love him this evening. I've heard theologies And I've heard philosophies People have opinions And their own point of view And I've heard preachers preach And I've heard teachers teach But it all comes down to The simple gospel truth I believe the book Every story that I've heard, every line and every word in those sacred pages, I believe it's true, written down for me and you, and it stood the test of time through the endless ages. And because of all it has done in I believe the book. The skeptic only finds ancient words from ancient times. They're quick to tell you that it's all out of date. But I see a timeless truth. My life is living proof of his power to save and I'm not ashamed to say I believe the book every story that I've heard every line and every word in those sacred pages I believe it's true written down for me and you and it stood the test of time through the endless ages and because of all it has done in me I believe the book from Genesis to Revelation from beginning to the end from the dawning of creation to the final amen I believe the book, every story that I've heard, every line and every word in those sacred pages. I believe it's true, written down for me and you, and it stood the test of time through the endless ages. And because of all it has done in me, I believe the book. I believe the book. Yes, I believe. tonight for who he is and uh, for everything he's done for me. I'm so thankful that the Bible is just not a fairy tale, but everything in it is true and um, it can help us through our lives and it has made a change in my life and I'm so thankful for that.
Well, I'm just worshiping the Lord tonight. I don't know about you. Just worshiping God. He's such a great God. He's been so good to me. He's been so faithful. I thank him for his promises. Peter calls him great and precious. And, uh, you know, there's not a lot that we can really put our trust in these days. You just don't know who to believe, you know. But you can believe God. He keeps his word. He's faithful. He not only promises, but he delivers on his promises. And I think about the stories in the Old Testament in my devotions. I'm reading in Exodus. And, you know, when God told Moses, go talk to Pharaoh, and I'm going to have you lead the children of Israel out. And he and Abraham went, here and Aaron went to speak to Pharaoh. And I, if I was him, I'd think, okay, we're going to talk to Pharaoh. And Pharaoh's going to say, okay, you can go. He didn't. It got worse. <laughs> you know, they took away the straw, and it got worse. And I thought, you know, Lord, we... We trust you, and yet sometimes it gets worse before it gets better. But thank the Lord, God was going to do something greater for Moses and for the children of Israel than they really expected. Not a simple solution. He was going to do something great. You know, God wants to work in our lives, and all we have to do is trust him. And we can. And this next song says, I believe God. Some place the trust in the wisdom of another. Some search for light in the dark. But like a child, I have come with simple faith in the only one who can change my heart. I believe God. I believe his word is true, for I've seen what he can do when I call upon his name. I believe God, so let the world say what they will. I will choose to serve him still, knowing he will never change. I believe. 
choose to serve and sin.